Hi everyone and welcome back to my channel. I'm Amor Antasia and I'm here today with the best fall slash autumn slash winter coats and jackets for this season. Also make sure you guys check out my previous try on hauls. I'm really trying to get more people to watch them because they're actually good. Like I actually have 50% off coupon codes and a lot of the um, items were on sale so you guys can still save a lot of money. And they're actually good quality clothes. So I'd like for you guys to please check out my previous try on hauls and leave a comment. Now this is not a sponsored video or anything like that. I actually saw this idea on a website forum where someone actually asked the question, you know, where do you go to find nice, affordable, stylish coats, stylish coats and jackets. So I said, well, let me just, you know, put you guys on game and show you guys where I get some of the new coats that I got. And also some coats that I've been having for years that are very durable and stylish but i've grown out of them so i'll definitely include those and i'll link all these jackets and the suggestions below in my comments well in my description box so make sure you check out my description box for the links to go and shop or whatever so without further ado let's go ahead and get into this haul we'll start with this first one that i just got from um zaful zaful definitely has nice jackets and coats you can look at this and tell that it's warm. Like looking at the fabric and the materials, this is basically a nice fleece plaid um, jacket. And the thing is though, with Zaful, some of their jackets are thin. They don't have linings, but this one does. So whenever you're shopping online for jackets, even if you're in person, make sure you feel in the inside of the jacket. Like actually put it on and try it on. Or if you're online, then read where it says descriptions and read the materials. You know what it's made out of and read if it has a lining because if it doesn't you're wasting your money I don't remember the price I think it was like about $30 30 40 bucks but they do have discount codes or whatever so I'll try to link uh, current discount codes for the sites that I got these from also yeah it's a cute jacket I like the quality you can see here like it's giving thickness oh it doesn't have pockets oh that sucks but yeah it's still a nice little cute warm jacket it's too small. I should have gotten a size medium. We're not going to lie here. I should have gotten a medium, but it's still a nice jacket. So if you do order this jacket, get it in a medium. All right, this next jacket, I actually have had this for about two years. And it has like these little cute, um, motor, it's like motorbike jackets, like little punk rock um, belts and stuff like that and accessories on it. It does have a zipper. I actually spent like $25 from, I got this from either Rainbow or Forever 21. Like a place like that because I knew that I just wanted it for the color and the style. So this isn't real authentic leather, but it's pleather. Is the biker jacket that has a lot of the detail. They're like bomber type length jackets. But I just like the open vibe. Like I like that style better. Okay, it does have a lining like I said. And it has a warm lining. Like it's nice and warm. Like it's not that silk type it's like an actual fabric so really nice and cute 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 okay i have another leather bike jacket i got this one either from fashion nova or it's been so long since i got some of these jackets i can't remember but i know this actually feels like real leather but it's not but i will link one that is very similar to it and i'll give other choices as well in different prices you know so that in case you guys think that $50 is too much for a jacket. Well, there's one, I'm sure I got this one for like 30 or 40. So I found some similar jackets from Boohoo for about $36 and they have different types of styles. And I also found these from Express. They also come in multiple colors for about 50 or $60 and I'll have them all linked below in the description box. But I've had this for at least two years, I believe. It's still lasting and it's not like fading or anything like that. And it's not peeling. Because some faux leather jackets do peel after about two, three years. So, yeah, this is a good quality jacket. This looks like a Macy's jacket, like a Vince Camuto type jacket. It does. It really does. So, this jacket reminds me of Natalie Nunn or Julie when she was like, I'm going to come back guns blazing. Natalie was like, guns blazing. <laughs> it was so funny. But, yeah, this is just a basic biker jacket. And I like how the back is kind of cropped up a little bit. And... It's just cute. Like when it's, it does this though, that's annoying. You know, if I actually want to wear it, like 
together and like i said it's been two years since i had this jacket so it's a little small but it's like perfectly fitted like it does fit so so yes don't sleep on rainbow and the stores like that are in the mall so this one is one of my favorites this is my everyday coat i got this from fashion nova in 2016 and it's a tweed jacket well tweed panels well, yeah, it's tweed, honestly. The back is tweed, but it does have leather panel, uh, leather sleeves, basically. And this is like sturdy leather. Honestly, I don't remember if it's pleather or not, because the coat was about 50 or $60, but it's worth it. And it is a very, very warm jacket, very warm. This is like snow proof. Now jackets like this will run you about 60 to 70 dollars. This is like the equivalent of a Steve Madden or Vince Camuto jacket, which are my favorites. Vince Camuto definitely in the last five years, but I used to be a diehard Steve Madden fan. So, you know, don't go cheap when it comes to getting a good coat because like I said, you can have it for multiple years. Look at this baby. This is my baby. Like it is so nice. And you see how it comes like down here. So I guess that's two quarters. But it is nice. And look how cute it looks when it's zipped, unzipped or whatever. Like, it's still stylish. Like, it's nice. I could, you know, put my hand deep down in there. So. Okay, so this jacket, this is actually a coat. But this is from Pretty Little Thing. This is a full length, four quarter wool blend jacket. Now, it does not have a lining, which I was disappointed in. This was my first purchase from Pretty Little Thing last year. But the fact that it has like the style that I really wanted, like the drape, uh, it's a draped coat. I really love that. And it does come with a belt, you know, whatever. So I did keep it for that reason. But all, anyway, it is still a nice jacket. It's not, it's actually warm. I was surprised at that. It's not like really thin. It's a nice wool blend jacket. Pretty Little Thing always has a 50% or 40% off discount coat. And I'll link that in the description box. And I'll try to link this as that jacket. If not, I'll link a similar one on the Pretty Little Thing site. And I'll uh, show you guys other drape jackets on other sites. But um, they always have a discount code. So it was a steal to get this for $30. So this is the, this is my Maxine Shaw attorney at law jacket. I feel like a lawyer or somebody in this. <laughs> but no, for real, I love the way that it like drapes. I should have ironed it. This is how it will look with the belt or whatever. And... It's just a nice drape jacket. It does look like the real thing as far as like just looking at it, if it was ironed or whatever, but it's still cute. Okay, so next I have another wool blend jacket. This one is warm also. It has a thinner belt, but it's a nice warm jacket. I got this one recently from Zaful. What made me fall for it was the leather trim. This is like a shawl type of uh, drape jacket as well but it's not as, you know, ruffled and everything like that, but it does drape. And it's a really nice jacket. It's very stylish. Like, this is chic. This is giving me Sex in the City. This is giving me New York and the 90s tees. Like, it's still nice and timeless. To me, it just makes you makes me feel like a grown woman. Like, this is, a, this is a coat that you can wear with heels, you can wear with boots, and it's just really fabulous to me. I think I got like 20% off. So I'll link a code and this link to this jacket for you guys to save them, you know, as much as you can, because that's what I like to do. I like to find all of the discount codes and then shop. So that's another tip. But this is another coat that's under $50. That is worth it. It doesn't have a lining in it, but it's still a thick wool blend. So this it's kind of dark over here. I don't mean for it to be dark in this room. It's my little studio room, but this jacket is everything like. Get into this leather trim detail to the bottom, like even to the bottom, like get into it. Really nice. I hate that it doesn't have a lining, like I said, but it is cute. Very chic. All right, so next coat, this is kind of like a jacket coat. This is from Zaful. This is just a big fleece jacket. It does have a lining. So it does have a collar, it doesn't have a hood, but I like this look better because I like to wear my own hats and things like that anyway. So this is uh, a size US for UK8, and you can still see the tag, I haven't worn it yet. It does have a nice lining in it, and it's very hot. This is a hot jacket, so make sure you have the deodorant on fleek. Like, make sure it is activated and you're smelling good. Because if you stink, baby. <laughs> All right, so I feel like a walking Twinkie. 
you know, a floating ding dong in this, but it is cute and stylish. I really like it. It's very warm, which is most important. And I love how it like cinches like at the bottom. It kind of, you know, it's like stretchy at the bottom or whatever. This is what I meant by like the waist, like it actually stretches. So if you're really thick down here, it's still stretchy. Nice deep pockets. I like it. Nice little warm Twinkie going on. Cute. The next item is one of my favorites. This is from a Zafool haul that I previously did. I did try it on in that haul. So if you want to check out my previous Zafool haul, I had a lot of cute stuff from Zafool. So make sure you check it out. But um, this is just a tweed plaid coat or tweed coat. And it has a little brown in it, like a little tan. So that's why I really like this jacket because I can wear it with tan outfits and black. But it has a lining and it does have pockets as well. And it's just, it's not double breasted, it's just, you know, one button, but it's a very nice quality jacket. It is kind of thick, and like I said, it does have a lining, so I like how it fits me, though. Like, it fits me very well. It's kind of, like, fitted, but it's a little bit just like, a, like an ounce of drape, like, you know, an inch, so I can still wear it over my shoulder and be really cute, really cute and chic. This is definitely Steve Madden quality. It really is. I look like a box in this. I guess it's because of the pockets or whatever, but... Yeah, the pockets are nice and, you know, semi-deep. But this is what, this is really why I got it. Because I want to wear it, like, on my shoulders. And the collar is not, like, a really, really big collar. But the jacket was only, like, 30-something with the coupon. It was, like, 40. So it has a lining and it does feel good. So to me, it's a nice quality jacket. Affordable and stylish. And this is the length in the back. So this next jacket, this is more, to me it's like a jacket. It fits like an oversized blazer. It does have a lining, but uh, this one is from Zafool. This is a size small, it's one size. And it's a little bit thinner than the other one. So this is definitely a year round type of jacket if you want to just have, you know, if you live in California or not. But this is definitely a nice stylish coat. That's really why I got it. It is double breasted and it does have a uh, pocket, but it reminds me of like an oversized blazer a nice thick blazer though so but it does look like an oversized blazer it's kind of like i said it's a little thin it's not really so you can even see the the fabric from the inside of this you know cheap lining but it's a nice little 30 dollar coat just to have it's not the thickest but i will link some thicker uh jackets but you know i just got it because it was cute and some of these pieces are just stylish for like just outerwear, like for pictures also, honestly. And for when I want to go out on a date or something like that or just go out and look cute because most of my jackets are like cute and stylish and warm, but not like the warmest. I do have some like durable warm jackets, but I don't always purchase jackets just because of the warmth. Sometimes I just like them because they're cute and stylish though. So. Um, this honestly was more so of a fall jacket. This is a shawl drape jacket. It's not as long as the um, other one. Um, it does not have a lining, but this one is from Zafool, but it is kind of thick. It's like a, a nice wool blend and it does have pockets. So I did like that. And this was about 32 originally so it's probably gonna be like 24 or something like that with the discount code i probably should have ironed this one too but this is just a little shawl jacket it is kind of warm but you know it's just like a, a lightweight jacket not necessarily like paper thin light but it's just a light jacket not necessarily a coat but it is cute and stylish and of course for pictures it looks really good like if you're wearing like a light gray um, pencil dress or something like that I could totally see this being on top of it I kind of wish it was a little longer but it's just what I got because I don't have any gray jackets so okay last but not least this is actually a jacket this is more like a windbreaker type of jacket it is very thin but it's cute and it comes with a hood so you can wear this on top well under another co uh, coat or something to you know make yourself look stylish this is giving me three little pigs I'll huff and puff and blow your house down, tease. I'll definitely huff and puff and blow your body away with this. Because, yes, it's very thin. <laughs> but it is a cute jacket. It really is. And this is how low it comes. The hood is in the back. And, yeah, y'all can tell that this is paper thin. 
but it's just a cute lightweight jacket just to have just for style and you can always wear a, a warmer coat on top of it but i just got it because it was cute and i thought it would be thicker but it's not so okay so that's it for the jackets that i have here physically with me but some of the previous jackets that i've had that i really love and adore and i'm going to find them again um definitely steve madden they range from about 55 to like 200 dollars but I got mine from Macy's and you know, Macy's always has good discounts. So I'll try to link, I'll definitely link a few of those from Macy's or Steve Madden in general. And I'll link a, a, a relevant or a recent coupon code for you guys. So make sure you check out my description box for that. And I used to have them in all colors when I was in college, but I've grown a little bit. Like most peacoats run you about $80, 80, 50 to like I said, 150. It just depends on the brand. Vince Camuto has very nice jackets out. A lot even Michael Kors but those are just good jacket suggestions I'll link I'll try to show the pictures as well on the screen and then I'll show links to them if you're just not the online type of person I would recommend JC Penney's uh, Macy's and then Dillard's of course Dillard's is more expensive but they do have yearly sales too Target used to have really nice jackets as well I just saw a few of them at my uh, local store and um, like I said Zafool Pretty Little Thing and Boohoo definitely Boohoo and Zafool so that's it for today's video. Thank you guys for watching and make sure you guys check out my descriptions box and check out my previous try on hauls and videos in general. Thumbs up this video and make sure you set your notifications to on. So thank you guys for watching and see you in my next video.